Aries, hello and welcome back. Um, this is going to be a reading for uh, mid of uh, January 2022. And Aries, we're going to see all of your energies. And um, we will see the past. An event that happened in the past, we will see your future, of course, where you are right now. You're focused on the energies that are coming to you and you don't know yet. We'll see hopes, you'll have a potential outcome, of course. Around this period, for the first uh, 15 days, for the two weeks of the new year. Of course, uh, still uh, is available, those you have not uh, seen yet. The extended reading for 2022 uh, you can um, find the link in the description box below there are some very good messages for you so two more here is So let's see. Oh. oh. <sighs> see your focus. Oh, that's good. In the past. See your strength now. <laughs> That's nice, right? The world changes and the hierophant is coming to you in the future. You right now, you have love around you. I don't know if you know or not. There are some uh, one person at least that loves you so much and is around you. I don't know if you know. And that person supports you. Anyway, we will see. Let, let me see your hopes. Okay about strength and a potential outcome. The energy around you for this period is the Six of Pentacles. The Six of Pentacles, uh, someone uh, will, uh, will want to um, generously give you love. There is someone that generously, generously wants to give you um, balance, wants to balance you wants to make you an offer that is very good for you financially and um, yes yes love love is around you absolutely absolutely i don't know if you know i don't know if you see the person that's around you because your strength that person supports you so much or wants to support you so much or will support you so much but no it's around this period so you have to look a little bit around you and see who has that love for you love is also coming to you you want love. Love is coming to you. Uh, the main message is that um, I feel that you want to be somehow independent. Leave the past behind. Make sure that you are in your own total power. Um, physically, mentally, uh, emotionally, spiritually. Uh, it is a process that is not the most easy, of course. Of course. Anyway, we will see. Success is coming to you as the energy that, is, that uh, you don't know yet. So we will see also. Let's see your past. You did something in the past that will lead you to, you took action, I feel, and uh, will lead you to your um, success, joy, uh, reason to celebrate. With your action something stopped the, well, you have the world of fortune at uh, your past something stopped and a new phase in your life started has to do with a partnership has to do with um oh that's good has to do with friends i see you getting um leaving things behind you could even be uh in energetic level energy level 
You left things behind you, so to go on to your two of ones, I read this card like pure fucking success. The, the, the good part for you, uh, Aries, is that what you wanted to stop to end a cycle and open a new cycle in your life with success, what you started in the past is coming to you as the energy that you don't know yet. It is the same card, two of ones. This is from the past, and this is from the energy that is coming to you and you don't know yet. Okay, a new phase has started and you have reasons to celebrate. You have reasons to become the stable queen of cups and make your wishes come true. Yes, it was the 2021 card of yours. The nine of cups making your wishes come true. I hope that most of you have done it. Okay, okay. Oh, wow, wow, wow. You want a one person. You certainly, there is one person that you want like crazy. You have it in your mind. You have that person in your mind and you, your focus is on having sex with that person, on uh, offering love to some to, to to that person and receiving of course love receiving that sexual passionate energy from that person and i see between love and um, and sex i see the best between the two of you i see the best between the two of you the point is not you the point is that person that person has um is a little bit distant let's say is uh, is not diving in something like this you are ready and that person still is a little bit uh, I will not say closed off but keep some kind of distance you may feel that that person at points is cold but you know what that person can offer you and you know that you want also this from that person let's see your strength Come on, this is this is absolutely amazing, you know. Because inside of you, I see that you have um, uh, there is a process going on that you might think that mm, maybe the love that I feel is only in my head. Maybe the love that uh, I want to have is uh, a utopia is not existing. No, no, Eris is existing. Is existing. I understand very well that. Uh, you may even doubt that there is uh, a person in this world that is your soulmate, that can understand you, that can feel you, that can love you the way, the same way that you can offer love. But the point is that, as I told you, it is here all around you. This period, there is a person, but you have to find that person. Maybe we will see with the cards now when we clarify. Uh, don't have such kind of doubts inside of you. Yes, there is love. Yes, there is a person that can love you the same way and as you want. To be your your other half in your life there is that person so have no doubts about this let's see your future at last at last at last it is the ending of a cycle that you had been sabotaging yourself uh, it is the ending of a cycle that you have thought that uh, what you started in the past can never show results to you. It is a cycle that uh, you have been disappointed by many things. But I see here um, the, the happiness that you feel that you thought that is difficult to happen. Like, for example, okay, uh, I find one person that has love for me, that is making good sex, that we can communicate, or we can feel love. Uh, we can do things together, we can go for uh, adventures, travel, we are the same page, we are the same level and um, maybe you have not found that person yet, so you have been a little bit disappointed inside of you. No, this ends, this is ending and do you know what, what is coming to you? The Ten of Cups, you are getting happy again you're getting happy and this uh, is a happiness that will not last only for some days or weeks or months what you can start now or what can come to you or the energy is born will uh, be born this around this period the mid of january for you 
So the energy that is being born is that you're getting off uh, your doubts, getting getting away from your doubts, getting uh, away from um, disappointments. Actually, you had been just sabotaging your own self and you're getting out. Where you're heading towards is your happiness, your own happiness areas. Let's see the lovers that is around you. Yes, it is the divine time. You had to wait too much. You had been so patient, waiting and waiting and waiting for this one that you thought at some point that no, it's not existing. You are wrong, it, it, it exists. Oh, of course, of course. Here is again the person that you want, but is not taking action. Here is another person that you know, that, or even if you don't know, that person knows you and wants to come to you uh, since some time now. Already we're talking about uh, the previous year, that person had seen you, wanted you, liked you, loved you, and has love to offer to you. Here we're talking about the King of Swords and the King of Cups, between them lovers for you. Between those two persons, there is love. And they are around you right now. They want to offer you love. And that King of Swords is not, mm, is not taking that much action towards you, actually. We will see, we will see. Why about this? Why is happening? Let's see the energy that is coming to you and you don't know yet. Oh, that's great. You are getting out of restriction series. You are... Oh, fuck. Again, this is the... The divine time, I, th I feel that 2022 starts so very good, it will start very good. Here we have the divine timing. Now is the right time to have your success. Now is the right time to leave things behind. It was a process, as I told you, it's not easy. That process is not easy. But you have started. And at the end that is coming to you, and you don't know yet, you're out of restrictions. No more restrictions. You have the Eight of Swords in reverse. You're getting out of this. We're talking about pure success. Probably you had been restricted in the past. That's why you could not achieve that uh, happiness, that success that you wanted in any level. Could be love, could be your career, your job, uh, some, your family. What I see is that getting out of problems. Maybe we're talking also about a person that is has distance from you. What you are becoming there is no surprise, of course, for me. But uh, you're becoming the Queen of Wands. You are finding back your energy, you are finding back your sex appeal, you are finding back the love for life, actually. And uh, this is brilliant, because I see you becoming the queen of wands. People around you, they want you, they love you, they want to come to you. Equal give and take everywhere, balance everywhere. People can be generous to you, and uh, happiness is there, for, is waiting for you, and the future is there for you. Is there for you, is. Let's see your hopes. You want to be strong about what? Facing your past. Now, that person hurt you. The king of wands hurt you in the past. And you want to be strong, to leave the past behind, to deal with the past. Maybe you're going to have news from that person. You want to be strong, so to move on from your past, from the king of wands. And let's see the potential, ouch, the potential, oh, oh, I like the potential outcome around this period is the Hermit. Again, Temperance, the third time that we see Temperance. You have so many options. You have so many options. Um, some of you that have been into that kind of Hermit mode, that have been isolated, that have been uh, you with yourself and... Uh, being happy there. <laughs> no, I see you that you will start exploring your options. Yes, it will come suddenly. Suddenly you will have this uh, enlightenment and say, well, what the fuck am I doing? Why? Why should I be lonely? Why should it, it was it was okay. I had to pass this, uh, this stage. I have to find things uh, with myself. I have to love myself first and then I will be outgoing. And then what is coming? Again, the temperance. Now is the right time to do it. You are start changing your whole life. And sex will also play a big part in this. On this. You are getting... Um, 
way more outgoing, going out and see options, see choices, chances that you are having with people, with uh, your career, with your work, with, uh, with your life. In the future, you have the Ten of Cups. There are three people around you. The one that you're hopes that you're hoping to deal with and maybe get over the person that hurt you in the past. But what you didn't, what you could not have, you are going to have it now. And you appear like in very good power. There is very good power. Um, I like, I like, I like when I see, of course, happiness. I like when I see love around you. I like it very much when you're focused in love and sex. Finally, you're getting it. You're getting out of your hermit mode. You're getting out of uh, your isolation, of your loneliness. And um, hmm, that's very interesting to see. If you want, you can join me in the extended reading. We will see the King of Car or King of Wands. That is at your hopes. Uh, what will bring to you? What will offer to you? And of course, we will see that lovers, those two people, the King of Swords and the King of Cups. Who is the one for you? Mm -hmm. The King of Wands that you want or hurt you in the past, the King of Swords or the King of Cups. What happened to them? Of course, mostly we'll see those two. And the King of Wands too. We'll see what's going on with that person now that probably is out of your life because I see that person attached to your past. So what has happened? We'll see in the extended what has happened with the person from the past and what uh, is going on with those two people that are, are around you and they promise to offer you love. Okay, um, there is, you will find uh, the link in the description box below. In any case, uh, thank you so much for watching and until next time, I wish you all the best. Take care of yourselves and uh, bye for now.